Hey guys, Evangelist Rob here of Rob Woods Ministries. I want to prophesy the glory of the Lord. It's rising upon you, my friends. In about four or five minutes max, I want to prophesy the prayer of faith for the glory of Jesus. Friends, when the glory comes, that manifests Shekinah, that Shekinah glory, the Shekinah, that effulgence, the glory comes upon you. It makes all the difference, the anointing, the manifest glory of the Holy Spirit. Jesus took Peter, James, and John to a high mountain, the three of them. They had to go to a higher place to have a different perspective. And the glory manifested. Jesus, his face shone like the sun. His hair became white as wool. And the glory manifested. God took Moses on a mountain. And after the sixth day, on the seventh day, the glory manifested. He stayed in the glory cloud. We've got to go to a higher place to experience and encounter the glory. Now, I'm not saying you should strive or crave. But as a result, when you commune with Jesus, when you have fellowship with him, the glory can and will manifest at times. It is incredible. You can see it sometimes. It's the most incredible, incredible thing now. Before I continue, I'd be li I'm live every Monday night, 9 p.m. Eastern New York on YouTube, prophesying for one hour, preaching the word of God. Come on the chat if you need prayer or a word or exhortation or direction. Present yourself on the chat. You can put pray for me. I'll prophesy the word of the Lord over you as best as God enables me. Subscribe to the channel. Now, Isaiah chapter 60 says, Arise, shine. Arise, get up. Get up and shine. Why? For your light has come. It's not coming. It's here. For the glory is here. How you're in the glory. If you're in Jesus, you're in the glory. The revelation of Jesus Christ is the glory of God. We worship till the spirit of praise. We praise till the spirit of worship comes. We worship till the glory comes. And then we stand in the glory. Let me say that again. We praise Jesus till the spirit of worship comes. We worship till the glory comes. And then we bask and marinate in the glory, a soak in the glory. We got to get our head in the glory cloud, in the glory of God, the manifest presence of the Lord, where miracles, signs and wonders, unexplainable things can manifest and accelerate that wouldn't happen in the natural because now we're in the supernatural. Now, I want to be careful. I, we should never seek encounters and look for them and strive. We should never use encounters to establish doctrine. We should only use scripture to establish doctrine. But again, Isaiah 60, arise, shine. Why? For your light has come. The glory of the Lord is rising upon you. It's ankle deep, knee deep, waist deep, and total immersion. Ezekiel was in a river, and the river rose from ankle, knee, waist, and total immersion, like the glories rising. It said, deep darkness cover the people, but the Lord will arise over you. His glory will be seen upon you. The Gentiles will come to your light, and kings to the brightness of your rising. Father, I ask you in the glory of Jesus, the Holy Spirit, the manifest glory to come upon everyone. Come on, guys. Position yourself and receive this. Close your eyes and just say, Jesus, fill me with the glory. I need the glory. I want more of the Holy Spirit, that manifest glory, the manifest presence of Jesus. That'll quicken you <coughs> and enable you, give you the strength to serve you. Take away problems, Erebashutara, for yea, when my glory comes, saith thy God. <coughs> problems dissipate because I'm magnified. 
and I become bigger because the truth is the Lord is bigger. Friends, Mary said, oh, magnify the Lord. Don't magnify your problems. Magnify the Lord. Hallelujah. <clears throat> Jesus is a whole lot bigger than any problem, trial, tribulation, challenge you have. You may be challenged right now. <clears throat> Excuse me, in financial realm, in in you know you may not be feeling well in this sickness realm, but Jesus is rising and His glory is rising upon you because it's come. And I prophesy the glory of the Lord Jesus to overshadow you, possess you, and take you. I'm looking for Jesus possessed people, not demon possessed people all the time. People that are Jesus possessed, that are possessed by the glory of Jesus. Hallelujah. Well, friends, praise the Lord. A little different, isn't it? <laughs> if you're not baptized in the Holy Ghost, open your mouth, begin to say, Out of my belly shall flow rivers of the glory of the Lord. Jesus, quicken my mouth to speak in diverse tongues. Friends, the Lord bless you. Subscribe. Again, I'm live every Monday, 9 p.m. for one hour prophesying the word of the Lord. The Lord bless you guys. Amen.